is our bridge to cross this this lake and now we're going into Zarek. We are here, we did it, we made it. How do you feel? Uh, right now I feel afraid uh, because the weather is kind of cold. Uh, it's very impressive, it's like we were in another planet, so uh, I don't know, I trust him so much. <laughs> It's a lot to handle though and a lot to get used to but uh yeah. Hello I'm Freezing <laughs> <laughs> Outside in the rain. In the beautiful school that I found. Oh yes. Mm. Bonjour, Charlotte. Bonjour. <laughs> and now, what do we do? We put the socks, the wet socks, and the wet shoes. How do you feel today? Ah. Uh, this morning I was super energetic, now I feel the tiredness. And now you climbed the mountain. But now that I climb and I, I see my destination, I'm super excited. <laughs> Hello. Hello. We're having a good time, right? Yeah, we are talking, we are walking and it's kind of nice. And the environment is nice, huh? Very nice, yeah. There's no Very wind. Impressive. Oh yeah, no the, wind. The, there's a little bit of rain, but it's... What a break, huh? Break, break in the rain. Perfect. I wanna go home. Inside you. Oh. I'm getting wet everywhere. Ah, oh, shit. So then maybe we set up the tent somewhere? No, the, the vest is keep walking. Poor baby! <laughs> <laughs> oh. 
Oh yeah, no the, wind. The, there's a little bit of rain, but it's very light. It's, yeah, we have much. a path we can walk on. Yeah, perfect. Like not like yesterday with you two. <laughs> 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 no video. We forgot to take water, so we're cozy and dry now, but somebody has to get out and... <laughs> yeah. Okay, you close. Bye-bye. Be careful. <laughs> He is crazy. <laughs> While I was trying to pass a river yesterday, I fall, I felt and well, I hurt a little bit myself. Alright. <laughs> Done. <laughs> Now finally the books we carried all along are worth it as well as the card game but I fear uh, I'm only gonna see Charlotte uh, next week when we are leaving here she's gonna stay in there all week <laughs> We have survived the storm. How did it feel to be in the middle of a storm? Uh, feels uh, frightening and very loud because there was like uh, raindrops super super loud everywhere like stones. Um, so yeah, it's not very relaxing, you know. It's not uh, when you are home uh, and there's a storm outside. No, it's different. <laughs> So some the first reindeer hmm. uh, <laughs> how is the the name of the empreint? Ah uh, and no A N T L E R um, uh? and lo A N T Yeah L E R. Okay. Antler. Antler. Empreinte. <laughs> Empreinte. Mosquito. So, Mr. Mr. Noah Akuna Matata is <laughs> gone. <laughs> To be an adult, and he's gonna be able to fight <laughs> with the nature. He's not gonna be a baby anymore. That's kind of beautiful. We just had some lightning and we were a little, a little bit worried that our wonderful middle trekking pole of the tent is a... Uh, we, we're gonna do a back to the future move, you know?
and we have to walk along there. Oh. What the fuck, oh? The path. Well, we made it, I guess, if the microphone is not full of water. 
So we went into the water and to the wood. Here it's wet. <laughs> So, uh, but yeah, we made it, we made it all across, all of this, I don't know if this was the place to do it really, but we made it, so, uh, bam, we managed to survive. Frozen. Frozen up. So we are in an awful situation because Charlotte has a fever, she has an infection and we are at a very remote place and had to figure out how to get away from here. Mm -hmm. Oh, I don't see another way. At the end of all this path, we arrived at the place we wanted to go, and it was a cliff. The river we, could, we thought we could walk up and along and across the mountain was 10, 15, 20 meters below us. It was a cliff going down. So I said, okay, uh, we gotta go back. We're gonna cross the river and we're gonna walk back to the place we came from to play it safe and to get back on a, on a route that was marked on our map and that we knew we could walk. We arrived to the point we were in the morning and he told me, how do you feel? Do you feel like staying here and we cross tomorrow? And like, <laughs> I was just, uh, I was in a moment of fire and I wanted just to get it done. And it was a huge adrenaline. Like I was feeling so bad so so bad but somehow i just forgot and i was just pushing pushing charlotte um, somehow overcame all this pain and the sickness and she was able to keep going and to keep pushing but definitely we were exhausted and we we were a little bit crazy Do it. <laughs> <laughs> what are we doing Wonderful. So the king says to the cat, Cat, thank you so much for those turkey. If you bring me more turkeys, I will give you the amount, the weight of the turkeys in pure gold. Uh huh. What a day, huh? We survived. <laughs> so here next to us they're camping camping scamping a couple. And he asked us like about our route and whatever. And we told him that we crossed this river. And he was like, huh? What? You crossed the river? Nobody nobody crossed that river. It's impossible to cross it. <laughs> and we were like, yeah, we we crossed it twice. <laughs> Taking Charlotte here, we were just joking about it. She did a two-day hike in Italy, 
and then the Zadek. <laughs> Two weeks Zadek afterwards. What the fuck? <laughs> Party is there or there? Uh, over that hill. <laughs> <laughs> there is the skiff here. <laughs> Mamma mia. What is this? This is my, my, <laughs> my jar of beautiful, beautiful peanut butter. It's the only thing that keeps me going, that keeps me believing. So many hard times me and the peanut butter went through together. So many hard times. And it never failed me and it always kept me Yeah, with the sense of there's something greater than me in this world, you know? Peanut butter. Do you know where the spoons are? But no. no? Where are the spoons? But I'm not even joking, I'm serious. Like after all this hard work we did today, where's the spoons? <laughs> Now he can't talk anymore, he's in an oh, orgasmic. Like, you see it move, the creaminess, you see this, oh, mamma mia. Winnie, Winnie ready. That's <laughs> better, that's better. Yeah. Everything with its time. First we do the, the prayer to the lords of the peanut butter, to our lord and savior, the peanut butter lord. You know what? Do you remember you eating peanut butter? Yes. You ate peanut butter and we got out of there. That's true. Yeah, it's because of the peanut butter gods. So, thank you peanut butter gods for letting us escape that hell. <laughs> and now, please give us the energy, peanut butter gods, to let us go to Akze or to Skirfe at least today and then walk out of here on the Kongsleden with <laughs> everything being fine and okay. Thank you, peanut butter. <laughs> Charlotte has less fever today, she's doing better, thankfully. Um, and I packed both my and her backpack all in this one. Or better have used this one, and uh, it's about 14 kilos or whatever, or 15, so it's really alright. And she only wears her the running pack we have for our day hikes. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. Amazing view, getting out of the Rapadan. It's flat. Here's another one. Cha! <laughs> <laughs> Really delicious water. How does it taste? Uh, it tastes like heaven. It's like you were drinking liquid heaven, huh? liquid clouds. Yeah, liquid clouds. It's yeah. like ambrosia, yeah. just Swedish. Just like mm. Swedish ambrosia. After the fight, you find the peace. Oh. Like, ooh. I think we should go up yeah, there. Yeah, we should go. Yeah, and the, like, it's really a gift also by the mountain, right? Because yeah. the last days were so hot and so exhausting, and now we have very beautiful weather, and we're very, very thankful that we are able to walk out of here in good spirits and as Charlotte said with peace and calm yeah. um, like the nature is forgiving us you know yeah right we entered she was like oh no now she's forgiving
look into the sunset, we had this this feeling of of having a shared secret with Noah. The, I feel something really, really special and exclusive somehow. That is a one life experience that it's just not possible to explain. We we are gonna try to share, but I feel just him, me, and the Zarek will know what happened there. So that's all. I'm almost crying. So after all this, uh, after all the, after all this trouble and work, we get a magnificent goodbye with a view on those massive black mountains covered in snow, probably not visible on the video. Um, yeah, and it really feels like we're walking out of there. Huh? Mm -mm. Feels like the ending. We still have one or two days or two or three days actually. Um, but not in the Zadek, so the story has come to an end, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Hi. Any last words? No, I, I keep the Zadek talk for us. <laughs> no, no more words. <laughs>